Asian stocks surged up on Monday following surprisingly strong U.S. jobs data, but gains were subdued amid concerns over the ongoing U.S.-China trade war. Concerns over Chinese economic slowdown due to the prolonged trade battle hit Asian equities as investors awaited news of whether the U.S. will go ahead with plans to raise tariffs on Chinese imports next week. Read more. China hopes to secure a trade deal with U.S. as soon as possible Japan's Nikkei 225 gained 0.33 percent, while MSCI's broadest index of Asia-Pacific shares outside Japan added 0.27 percent. China's SSE Composite Index edged up slightly at 0.08 percent, while Hong Kong's Hang Seng Index was virtually flat, gaining 0.03 percent. European equities are expected to give up some of the gains made on Friday following strong U.S. non-farm payrolls data. The FTSE opened slightly lower, and was down around 0.2% by 8.30 a.m. Germany's DAX and France's CAC 40 each lost around 0.1% in early trading. The markets were relatively timid at the start of the session, which is forgivable considering what is at stake, said Spreadex's Connor Campbell. The pound just about continued its pre-election rise, adding 0.2% against the dollar and 0.1% against the euro following a salvation poll giving the Tories a 14-point lead, he said. Meager movements, admittedly, but enough to send cable to a fresh seven-month peak of $1.317. Even better, it leaves sterling at a 31-month high against its single currency cousin, i.e. its best price since not long before the 2017 election. The U.S.-China trade war is set to remain at the forefront of traders' minds this week, with Washington scheduled to impose tariffs on more than $150 billion of Chinese imports on 15 December. Beijing confirmed last week that it will waive import tariffs on some U.S. pork and soybean imports, raising hopes that progress could be made in trade talks. Read more. Tallow oil boss steps down as firm cuts guidance amid disappointing performance Chinese assistant commerce minister Ren Hongbin said on Monday that the country hopes it can reach a trade agreement with the US that satisfies both sides as soon as possible. But Campbell warned, as soon as possible still might not be soon enough. Especially since, at present, there are no plans for face-to-face -face talks between Trump and Xi Jinping. For more on this story, visit the news article link.